You know, there's not much a New York lawmaker can do about the new law that effectively bans abortions in Texas, but that is not stopping Governor Hochul from trying. News 12's Antoinette Biorti joins us with more on that. Well, state leaders gathered in Central Park today to announce their opposition to the controversial Texas abortion law, and they welcomed those struggling into our state. Governor Kathy Hochul was joined by Democratic leaders and women's rights advocates. She says the state is working to help women in need, calling the Texas decision, quote, a violation of basic rights. The new Texas law makes any abortion after six weeks of pregnancy illegal in the state. Senator Kirsten Gillibrand reacted to the news, and in response, Governor Hochul says she's launching a public information campaign to make women in her state aware of their rights. You're denied the choice that should be yours as a woman, and something we took for granted by Texas, who thinks six weeks is the magic date that you should have been aware, you should know this. <laughs> and that is grotesquely unfair, what they're expecting. It is shocking, shocking what they did in Texas. And Texas isn't alone. Texas is just the first big idea that these conservative legislators have all throughout America. Well, Governor Hochul says she's also working to update New York's regulations to allow doctors to prescribe medications that lead to abortion remotely using telemedicine. Antoinette Beorty, News 12. Now that Texas law which prohibits women from getting abortions six weeks into pregnancy now being challenged in federal court by the U.S. Justice Department.